When I see this much cash, I think to myself, ooh, let's go shopping. But I really hate going to the store and you can't really spend cash online. Fine, I'll just go fund my cash envelopes. Hey there, I'm Wendy Valencia, and on this channel, we talk all things money. No, seriously, there is no money topic that I won't tackle. Here, we focus on living a debt-free lifestyle, so if that is something that interests you, make sure you click that big old red subscribe button down below. First, I would like to state that all of my bills are finally facing the right direction, and they actually came out of the machine like this. Second, I'd like you to notice, I am not in my car and I am not in danger of getting robbed. Woohoo, way to be safe. It's like a Valentine's Day miracle. So January was actually pretty great and we actually had $60 left in my wallet. And so I am gonna pull that right out and set it aside so I can take it and deposit it back in the bank so I can use it at the end of the month to put towards debt. If you're new to these parts, me having any cash at the end of the month is a pretty huge win for us because that never happens, ever. Hey, Wendy, why did you go ahead and take out all of your money when you knew there was $60 left in the wallet? Actually, I did not know there was $60 in there until I started cleaning up my wallet to film this video and I found it mixed up in some receipts. So I actually thought we had spent all the money. <laughs> So this is month three of our brand new, not so new wallet system. And I gotta tell you, I remember why I stopped using this wallet. See, this wallet is actually real crocodile and leather. So these little pockets here stretch and I don't have that many cards anymore. And so they slide out really easily. So I ended up, now it looks like I got a ton of cards, but that's because I took business cards and such and stuffed them in there so they would actually stop sliding around so much. I've had a ton of people ask me where I got this wallet from. And I have to be honest, I bought this wallet about, gosh, like at least 10 years ago when I lived in Nicaragua. I bought it at a local market there. It was manufactured there and I love it. And seriously, if I ever wanted to have a business, I might go down there and buy a bunch of them and sell them in the US. They're pretty awesome. But I did scour the internet in case you wanna do something similar because this really is a pretty awesome way to manage your cash envelopes. So I scoured the internet and I'll put some links down in the description box if you wanna go and check out any of those. Maybe you'll find something similar that you like. The, the Sensi wallets are actually kind of similar. So let's just jump into funding these bad boys. So we only took out $500 this month. Why? Because we're still in semi-storm mode and we decided that it was best that we not do family fun money this month. So for those of you that thought Mauricio and I might be going on a Valentine's Day date, yeah, that's not happening. So the plan is to not spend all of this money this month and try and hold on to it as best we can. This will kind of be a test of how much resolve we have. So the first thing we got is 240 for the grocery budget. 100, one, two, three, four, five, 200, one, two, 240 for the grocery budget. And I will tell you, I'm super excited about this because I've actually started keeping receipts and coupons in here. These are actually coupons from CVS. I've been able to use coupons because I actually have them in here. It works out really well. So next we have blow money. One, two, three, four, five. 100 for Mauricio and one, two, three, four, five, and 100 for Wendy. And again, even though we're in semi-storm mode, we did decide to go ahead and fund our blow money for this month. We're just going to try and be a little more conservative because we know ultimately that no matter what happens, we'll be getting paid. It just might be delayed a little bit. And then I have $20 for the dry cleaner. And Becky6066 made me these cute little cash envelopes and I am really enjoying them, and I will definitely be ordering more if we have more cash categories, because they work really well in this wallet. 
and Sally Beauty is $20. And then Mauricio's haircut is $30. And I didn't get a 10 from the bank because I used the ATM. And so I'm taking $10 out of my blue money that I had left over from last week because that's just easy. And it saved me having to take another $20 out of my wallet. And so now we've got $30 for Mauricio's haircut. So we are all cash enveloped up and ready to go. If you are new to my channel, make sure you click on my big laughing face to subscribe. And I will put up two videos so you can keep on watching. This video is my latest one. And this one is one YouTube picked out just for you. So I'll see you in the next one. See y'all.